As modern cities expand in boundary and concentration of mass, the question of preserving cultural identity and meaning through new construction has been largely sacrificed. This is largely due to the treatment of architecture as commodity and the rise of the Starchitect phenomenon, which sells a fixed image rather than a response to context. By researching precedent projects which engage in a dialogue of critique with their context, I will devise a set of architectural strategies which can be implemented in the design of new buildings within dense urban contexts. Specifically, these strategies will encompass design criteria for preserving urban identity and a greater sense of place, as well as physical means of construction through a conscious tectonic language. A building will be designed and rooted within the research architectural strategies, the context and culture of the site, and the appropriate means of construction for implementing this design in a dense urban environment. As a result of this project, we will have a better understanding of how urban identity is created and preserved through the creation of new architecture. The current proposed site for this thesis is Orionsplatz in Munich, Germany. Currently, it is a public square located in the heart of the city and houses a wide variety of events on weekends and every now and then on weekdays as well. Unfortunately, the square is ill-prepared to receive many of these events and almost all of them require the erection of some kind of temporary structures or power cables or other forms of utilities which take away from the overall experience of the space and the historical presence of the buildings which frame it. This is the immediate boundary of the public square as seen from above. Looking a little bit closer we can see the density of historically relevant architecture in the vicinity of our site. The goal of this project will be to highlight the existing culturally relevant buildings while adding value and experience to the modern presence of the site. This can be achieved by considering architectural interventions in any of the highlighted zones. There is a variety of strategies which can be considered when approaching this design problem. One is to facilitate spatial interaction by an intervention which creates an artificial crossroads of thoroughfare within the existing space. Another potential strategy is to merge existing spaces by the removal of volume and mass. In this particular site, the strategy can be rather tricky due to the fact that many, if not all, of these buildings are historically protected and are very relevant to architectural culture and history of the region. Nonetheless, this is a potential to answer the question of preservation versus progress in a site such as this. As a third option, one could focus on an extension to the Feldenhalle, which is the primary venue for most of these events happening throughout the week and weekends.